watching What's Trending Live from the Samsung Vlogger Lounge at South by Southwest in Austin, Texas. I'm Cheryl Lazar. I'm so excited just to start off our final day here of our live coverage. My favorite, Tyler Oakley, everyone. Give it up for Tyler. Hi. It's just always a pleasure. Honestly, whenever I see your name and I'm like, oh, Tyler's going to be somewhere. Can we get him again? Because you're, you're a great friend, I drop but, everything but for Cheryl so Lazar. So, well, you're here at South by for a panel, the uh -huh. new TV star, How to Build an Online Audience. Yeah. Isn't that incredible there? You know, you are a new TV star. See, but here's the thing. I, I'm not a TV star. I'm I'm just a new type of entertainer, I guess. Yeah. Um, I'm just having fun. I just make content. Hashtag content. And uh, hope that people hashtag enjoy content. it. Hashtag team internet. Hashtag, right. hashtag. A lot of people are like, oh, is TV the next step for a YouTuber? Yeah. Or is movies the next step? Or whatever, you know, whatever the next step is. But I'm a very firm believer that for me, uh, my next step is adding things to what I'm doing, not leaving YouTube to go do other things. And you've added many things this past year, a podcast even. Yeah. It's called Psychobabble. Mm -hmm. It's with my best friend, Corey Cool. And what I've found is it's just, I, I love doing it because it's the most fun I have all week. And I think people respond to that and they can feel that it's a completely different vibe. Um, well, why is that? Because you do so many different things that are... It's, I mean, A, cool there's something awesome. magical about just having an audio thing. Also, it's very long form, where on YouTube, I, you, you're encouraged to have much shorter content, yeah. uh, where you have to be more concise, kind of wrap things up in three or four minutes. With the podcast, we can dive deep into a topic for 30 minutes, and uh, I think people respond well to that. So if there's something I would make a video about in five minutes, I, I can dive deeper into it and uh, really the, talk about stuff. What are the things you li like to dive deeper into? <laughs> Can I help you, Cheryl Lazar? Um, Actually, that's going to go on Tumblr. What are the you're a mess.com. Uh, what do I like to dive deep CEO. into? Well, I love the podcast because we get to talk about um, current events, social media, um, uh, you know, celebrity feuds, those types of things, where I wouldn't necessarily make videos about those because yeah. it's like, it's not very topical a year from now and I like my YouTube content to have staying power. That's interesting, I noticed that. Now but that like podcasts, like I'll do something that's like topical to that week um, and it lets us like kind of talk about what's going on in the world that moment. Yeah, so that's interesting. You just mentioned something for your YouTube, how you approach your content because I never really thought of that. Well, I don't really not have an I, approach. I, I, I'm a mess. I know. <laughs> Oh, so you're a mess.com. Mess.gov, yeah. <laughs> um, what were we talking about? We have some people that are, oh, oh my God, Lisa actually tweeted, oh my God. What did Lisa guys. say? You're a mess.com. <laughs> you're gonna just spread that across the Listen, internet. Listen, make it happen. Aren't you? We actually, should I go to the, should I go check Twitter? Yeah, what are people, what are people saying? I know, I, oh, by the way, live on here, I'm gonna let you know that you hit 400,000 on your prize, you We hit 400,000? There you go. Yay! Congratulations. Wait, that's awesome. Um, so, what message do you have for everyone? That's awesome. Uh, well, if people don't know what it is, uh, we're raising money for the Trevor Project. The Trevor Project is the leading national organization for crisis and suicide prevention. So Trevor Project is really important to me. So we raise money for them every year. And the goal this year is $500,000. And we just hit 400000 That's so cool. Congrats. Did you always think that you were going to be such a strong and powerful voice for the LGBTQ community? No. And I still don't think that. I don't know. I just am trying to be me. I'm just trying to do me. But like, um, was that, you obviously, you are you, but. Well, here's the thing. It's like, I don't think anybody joins YouTube thinking, oh, I'm, I want to be a role model or, oh, I want to have influence in quotes or anything like that. It's, it's one of those things where you find yourself with an audience maybe, or with some people watching and you start to get messages from people and you realize that the, the impact that you can have. And so, although it was never my intention to have people watch and have it be a thing, um, I definitely don't take it lightly. I, I understand the impact that I can have, whether it's good or bad. Yeah. Um, and over the years, I've learned more and more how to use what I have for good, I think, hopefully. Thanks for watching our coverage live from the Samsung Vlogger Lounge at South by Southwest. To watch another awesome video, click right here. Subscribe for more, like, let us know what you think in the comments below.